Hi, I'm Holly of Renewal Fitness and Nutrition Coaching, and I'm a registered dietitian and a holistic nutritionist. So what does that mean? What is the difference between a registered dietitian and a nutritionist? That's what I'm gonna teach you in this video. Basically, anyone can call themselves a nutritionist, although they're generally regarded as some sort of an expert in the field of nutrition. However, there's no governing body or regulating agency that determines who can use the term nutritionist. So if your aunt decides to teach her friends and start charging people for how to eat healthy because she's learned a lot about how to eat healthy, she could call herself a nutritionist and charge for that. Also, there are nutritionists who do go through programs and who may go through schooling to become a certain type of nutritionist. So the background, the education, the certifications and the qualifications can completely vary because it's a very general and vague term. A registered dietitian is a term that you have to have a license to use that term. And a registered dietitian nutritionist is another way of saying registered dietitian. So every registered dietitian is also a nutritionist but the same is not true in reverse. So a nutritionist cannot call themselves a registered dietitian because they have not gone through the proper schooling, credentialing, and board exam to call themselves a registered dietitian. A registered dietitian has to go through a bachelor's program where they get a degree in nutrition or a related field through an accredited program by the organization Ascend. Then that person has to go into a dietetic internship. This is typically close to or up to a year with certain components that have to be a part of that and certain qualifications that have to be met to complete at least a thousand hours of that internship. They are then allowed to sit for the RD exam. So this is basically like a board exam for dietitians and then you have to pass it in order to become a licensed registered dietitian. So typically the process is quite a bit more strenuous to become an RD, and the focus with a registered, a registered dietitian, also called an RD, is really more in the medical realm. So RDs are allowed to help treat diseases, they help with patients in the hospital, and they can work in a variety of settings. So I am both a registered dietitian and a nutritionist. So from my perspective, who would I recommend you work with? So this is just my personal opinion, but having experienced both sides, I would recommend that you work with a registered dietitian with some caveats to that. So the reasons why I would suggest you work with a registered dietitian is again, the qualifications are just much greater. There's typically much more education and it's a little bit more trustworthy. When you have an RD, you know exactly what process they've gone through to get their education, to get their knowledge. You know that they've agreed to a code of ethics, to standards of practice in their care. So it's a very trustworthy source. Oftentimes, two registered register dietitians in private practice will take insurance, or if you're at a hospital, you can use your insurance to see the registered dietitian, where typically nutritionists cannot use insurance. Registered dietitians are often gonna have just a better understanding of all the little components that are at play from everything from your body and physiology to food to medication and all these other little things that can affect you. Whereas sometimes nutritionists may not have that same foundational knowledge and so they may make recommendations that may not be as safe simply unknowingly, not with any intention to do harm, but just because they don't know. Now, here is my caveat to that. Being around a variety of dietitians, I find that quite often, and this is a good thing, but dietitians will get pretty honed in on their area of expertise. So if they're working in a hospital, they're gonna be mostly used to acute care. If they're working in a dialysis clinic, their focus is gonna be kidneys or diabetes or so on. And so sometimes they get so focused in that area that they might stop doing as much education around other areas of health and wellness. And so it may just be a little bit more of a myopic and medical type of approach. They may not have as much of a whole person, holistic approach when it comes to helping their patients or clients. 
That's not always the case by any means, but that may be the case with many dietitians. Many nutritionists who are not registered dietitians may have gone through quite a bit of programming or schooling to learn more of a integrative or functional or holistic approach when it comes to food and the body. And so they might have that added benefit of a very whole person, get to the root cause kind of education and a little bit greater understanding of maybe other areas like toxins and how those affect you or herbs or other natural products. Again, not always the case, but that may be the case with many of them. So depending on what your situation is, in my opinion, ideally for practically any situation, I would want to look for a registered dietitian who also has some sort of knowledge and value for this more integrative and functional approach to medicine and to health and use optimal food and nutrition to help the body heal itself. Again, this is just my opinion because I am a very holistic type of person that looks at every little aspect of our world, our environment, our health, our bodies, and wants the most natural and optimal way of managing health and nutrition and helping our bodies to take care of themselves. So many others may not agree with this and that is totally fine, but that's why I chose to both get a certification in holistic nutrition as well as become a registered dietitian to give me the best of both worlds. And if you are looking for help, I have on my website a resources page that has lots of great free downloads and a page with meal plans. So if you're looking for more help with nutrition, you can get a meal plan and a variety of resources that are also free to download on my website at renewalfitcoach.com. Additionally, I do offer services as both a registered dietitian and nutritionist and fitness coach. So if you are looking for help in any, any area of your health, I would love to help. You can contact me to book a free consult at renewalfitcoach at gmail.com. I would love to help you. And until the next video, blessings on your health and fitness journey.